So the last few years, we've been really close to getting the playoffs, but there's been a few mishaps or missed goals, whatever, to keep us out. And then this past year, we got in and we made it to the first round and played Roanoke again. We did significantly better the second time we played Roanoke, and that's making the team have a lot more confidence coming into this year. Gives us more hope for like continuing to go into the playoffs every year. So this year we have a lot of younger guys. We have about three quarters of the team is sophomores and freshmen, but the sophomores that are coming back this year had significant play time last year. So they're gonna be big helps on the way through. They're significantly more experienced than some of the things sophomores are. So like Eric Hustlebaugh is gonna do a great job this year. We got Brandon Schick leading our close defense, Jared Barley and Pellegrino in there. Uh, we're gonna be good this year. Last year was the first time we made it to the playoffs. So going into this year, that's going to be our expectation is to make it there again and obviously try to make it further. So it's just working into the, the new offensive shot clock, getting efficient, winning the games that maybe we came up short or the, the teams that gave us some trouble. So Roanoke, Lynchburg, trying to just get closer to beating them so we can ultimately get our goal to win an ODAC championship. For practices, obviously it's a new group of guys, a lot of new guys. So they're all coming in focused, aggressive, so it's making practices aggressive. Yeah, it's making it easier to switch into the new rules. It's, everyone's just trying to get ready to obviously play the first game. And I think everyone's mentally focused and ready to start off on a high note.